Okay, so in order for you to grow your actual network marketing business, it's crucial that you can position yourself as the expert authority. And the only way you're going to do that is by creating massive use value content. So I'm delivering you to you directly right now the exact framework which you need to make sure that you position yourself in the eye of the storm so people chase you, people say, I've got to work with this individual. And so there's a specific framework, there's specific step-by-steps which you need to incorporate in every single one of your content, in your videos, in your articles, in your blogs, in your actual website copy which is going to make people instantly see you as the expert authority so stay tuned right now I'm going to show you directly how this is done and so ahead of the webinar you can implement these strategies and you can become the hunter instead of the hunter enjoy Okay, so you need to make sure that you're focusing purely on creating massive use value content, making sure that you stand out from the crowd. And so the way to do that is via a framework, via a structure, okay? So as we can see on this, we've got these sticky notes. You wanna make sure that your content that you create can actually be put down on little sticky notes and it's that easy for anybody to understand and also for advanced people to understand as well. So you have gotta be able to hit it from both sides of the actual um, field. Now, if we move forward, the main factor which you want to focus on is always identifying the problem first. As we can see in the image, there is the fire truck there and there's a smoke, but there is no smoke without flame, etc., etc. So you've got to make sure that you identify that, hey, if you want to be able to be successful, if you want to join this business, you need to know that there are certain things you need to be doing successfully before you even join the opportunity. And so let me teach you those frameworks right now. So that's what you do. Obviously, you identify the problem that is facing in their life. Or if the problem is that they're not making enough money or they are, you know, they're working too much or they want to leave the nine to five, you need to identify that problem and you need to show them the solution. So stop pitching, pitching, pitching. As we see in the image, you know, salesmen by appointment only. Nobody likes to be pitched to about lotions and potions and why you should join your team. Stop doing that. Stop pitching in your videos. Stop pitching in the content on your website and your articles on the blogs. Make sure that you just focus on giving massive use value. And you've also, as you see here, you've got to have that unique selling point. You've got to be able to stand up from the crowd because everyone is talking about the same stuff. If you go on YouTube, for example, and type in your business name or your business opportunity, etc., you'll see everyone talking about the same things over and over and over again. There's no one who's got that unique selling point. You need to make sure that you have that unique selling point. Now, do not hold back. You know, you want to leverage yourself in the best format, and, and you know, the best format, which is video, but do not hold back. And what I love about Apple is that they always seem to over deliver whenever they're actually creating their actual promotional videos and also their actual products. So they always over deliver and always give massive use value on what the major features are of the actual product and why we cannot live without these products. So make sure that your content that you create is similar to that. Okay. Now, once you do this, this is how your life will improve, literally. You know, and this is a men the mindset that you have to adopt when you actually are creating your content. It's following the law of reciprocity. Um, because people believe that when they're viewing your information, they're saying, look, if this is what he or she is giving away for free, I cannot imagine what it would be like to work with them one-on-one -on -one or to be part of their team. And they have that level of gratitude. So always over-delivering the material that you create. And once you've done that, you know, your leads will be pre-sold and they'll be eager to buy on demand and they'll be rushing to join your downline. They'll be rushing to join you in your business. The other factor is this is the fun business. You can travel and you can create fun videos and you can become that celebrity in your marketplace. You can be that vlogger. And now what's a vlogger, you may ask? It's a video blogger. It's someone who has got an actual brand out there, just like Oprah, for example, and the actual um, TV. But you'll be having created that brand where people just are drawn to your every word, your every message. And so that's what you want to make sure that you position yourself as. And so, like I said before, the law of reciprocity, you give and you shall receive. As you see in this image, it's like the Red Cross and them people giving aid and people are so appreciative. And that's what you need to do when you're creating your content, when it's people looking to join you in your business, then they need to see this is what it will be like once I join in the team. This is the strategy he's given me or she's given me a strategy and a technique I can implement right now, right now and free. I can't imagine what it'd be like. So they're so grateful. And like I said, this is the law of reciprocity. If you give, you shall receive. And then, of course, you need to know how to transform your content, okay? So 
There is a simple way you can do this. As you can see, um, the, you know, the transformer that goes from the robot into the car and the car into the robot, etc. So a strategy that you can use is you can go to something like eZine Articles or eHow.com or Ask Jeeves, etc. And you can convert what is an article, what someone may have wrote about a particular topic area concerning your business, and you can take what has been put in that article and you can turn it into a video. Use it as a script and turn it into a video. The key aspect of creating massive use value content starts with you want to make sure that you sell the sizzle and not the sausage. If you look at this actual image of the sausage, you know, oftentimes when we even think about sausages and, you know, on the barbecue, it's the very smell which draws you to wanting to eat the sausage, okay? Or it may even just be the look of the sausage. So your content, make sure that it is great, but it's just got enough to make them want to go to take that next action step, which may be getting in touch with you over the phone. It may be joining you on your webinar. It may be actually buying your product or joining you in the net, in the actual program or the opportunity, okay? So sell the sizzle and not the sausage. Make sure that you do not give too much so whereby they don't want to actually connect with you. And that's key. And of course, here's a little bonus. You want to make sure that you can teach via a framework. And there's no better example of teaching via frameworks than, you know, um, the dummies books because they are always given specific step-by-step -step instructions, what to do now, then this is the next step, and then this is the next step. And that's the same way in your videos and your articles and the content and when you're creating massive use value, you want to teach via this particular framework, which is an introduction, then you tell your story, then you tell the problems that you faced, then you tell the solution that you found, then you tell them the design outcome, and then you tell them, hey, and if you want to find out more, make sure you click this or make sure you go over to this website or make sure you call me on this direct number, okay? So this is so, so powerful. You've got to make sure that you're implementing this strategy so that you can become the hunted instead of the hunter. And let me give you one final bonus. You've got to share the tools necessary. People want tools to be able to equip them on the way up the mountain and down the valley to actually reach that, that pivotal of success, to reach that peak point. And so make, actually make sure that you're sharing the particular tools necessary. Tell them how easy it will be. Tell them look, all you need is a webcam, all you need is a laptop, all you need is editing software. Hey, at the end of the day, all you need effectively, therefore, is an iPhone or an iPad because it's all built in. So now is your opportunity to position yourself in the eye of the storm for you to become the hunter instead of the hunter. I want to teach you this even more in depth directly on the webinar. So do not be late. And I'm going to share a little message with you right now about what you can do in order to make sure that you can be attending this event and position yourself in the eye of the storm. Okay, so that was great, hey? Now, these strategies and these techniques, I've just shown you a little taste of what's to come on this webinar. You need to know the exact blueprints, the exact step-by-step -step framework on how to incorporate this for your business. So, make sure that you show up at the webinar at least 10 minutes in advance so that you can make sure that your seat is reserved because I'm going to be going even more in depth on how to do this for your business. Make sure that you get on that webinar. I'm going to see you very, very shortly.